to episode 7 of Baldur's Gate Descent into Avernus. Or as we are starting to lovely, lovingly call it, the party goes to hell. Before we begin, we always like to thank our sponsors, D&D Beyond, that's D, the letter N, D, Beyond.com, as well as Lucky Dice Cafe. Despite the fact that we are not running any live games with Dire Bear right now, um, due to the necessity of social distancing, we still like to shout out our main analog uh, location. So when all of this is over, and you need to get out of the house and go play a little D&D live with your friends in the Huntsville, Alabama area, that's the place you should head. Go check it out. We're running a little bit late tonight. We apologize about that. But it was an unforeseen Zoom issue. Was it even with the new program we've been testing all week? It was, in fact, an issue with Zoom. But we've gotten it fixed. Everything is fine. And we're ready to move forward. And when we last left this party, <clears throat> they had just finished fighting off a large suit of, well... It wasn't really animated, animated armor. It was a helmed horror. And, uh, well, they dispatched it with some issue. Some. Um, and if you tuned into our last episode, Emmerich did mention that he knew where his mother was. This was incorrect. Um, but he does mention that his brother may know where his mother might be at this time of day. Adira. You know what's coming. There is a sharp, almost piercing pain right behind your eyes. And you know that you need to sit down and get the charcoals and parchment out. As soon as you sit down, your parchment is out in front of you with your charcoals. There is a... Anybody who's looking sees uh, one of the rolled up sides of the, sides of the parchment has um, some drawings on it that you can't really see unless you were to unfold it. Um, and Adira, you sit down and you don't remember seeing anything. One moment you're sitting with blank parchment, the next moment you're sitting there with a completed design in front of you. But what you experience are flashes of something. You're not sure what they mean yet. It's always revealed later, and typically it all makes sense later. Um, but you see the image of a young man, a shield what looks to be this weird cube with inscriptions on it, and then an entryway that looks more ornate and advanced than anything you've ever seen before. It's definitely not local. Is anybody else paying attention to what is going on? If I saw Adira stumbling, I would Kind of be like, uh, Adira? Adira? Yeah, there's not much I mean, going on. So She doesn't, she doesn't stumble. That's she goes a... behind the desk. Okay. And then immediately pulls out parchment and charcoal and then starts sketching it. Her hand moves over this paper incredibly fast, but incredibly accurate. Mom, don't move yourself into the fog of war. I was um, trying not to, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Um, her hand is incredibly fast and accurate over this paper. I mean, how quickly, how quick is this? We're talking, it takes her about a minute to do. Huh. Um, I mean, I guess I would notice, but I wouldn't care. It's one of those yeah, kind of like, you see them go behind the desk, you're like, oh, whatever. I'd be morbidly curious. Kai's interested. Okay. Uh, Adira, when you come to, what do you do? Uh, 
uh, intricate markings on it. Uh, and for anybody curious, um, what you see is, for anybody who looks at it or if Adira feels the need to show it, this is what you see, and mostly because I want Q to show it on, on stream. Ooh, anime pretty. Ooh. Interesting. I see. Kai Star looks. Are you are you okay? You kind of looked out of it there for a minute. It's either a good thing or a bad thing. Uh, all right. Well, shall we? Uh, I was going to um, during this minute and that their conversation, I'd go up to a call. So, I've never seen you take off your armor. Why? Oh, it's, uh, I'm very fond of it. Well, obviously, but I've seen you go to bat with it. It's crazy. I'm very fond of it. I make sure to help keep it in shape and wash it. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. What, what we co-designed it special. <laughs> oh my god, this is the epitome of the helmet stays on. <laughs> <laughs> But yes, that, that's a... Uh, yeah. I don't get it, but okay. I'll uh, leave it be for now. Still, Thank you're you. weird. And you're a talking cat. <laughs> there, there are more than me out there. You do realize that. I am what we call a race of people. Very, yeah, no. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the call just kind of walks off. <laughs> <laughs> so I just walk off with, uh, uh, baffled. <laughs> Love it. Love it. <clears throat> okay. Oh, man. That's amazing. Yes. Yes, it is. So, um, what do you guys want to do? There is the staircase that heads up, um, but there is also the brother that you need to go talk to. Uh, Where I was think, the brother? Yeah. I don't remember. Uh, he tells you that he's in one of the bedrooms that's on this floor. I think the priority is the brother. I'd rather go see the brother. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Amrick leads you to this room here. I'm just with the party. I'm not gonna move. Yeah. Um, and Emmerich does assure uh, this these guards that nothing, nothing untoward should happen. Just my entourage of strange people. Yeah, something and like a cat. That. <laughs> I'm just going to do the courtesy. I'm just going to like knock on the guy's door. <clears throat> Thank you. I got you. Apologies. Hang on. 
Yeah. What is that? Oh, that's right. We have the old man cat. I keep forgetting. <laughs> old man cat. The Tressum? Old man cat. Cat with wings. <laughs> um. Okay, so who's going to open the door? Because you are told to enter. Uh, oh, I think the brother should walk in first. Definitely. Hands are bound. No, I'll, I'll walk in with the brother, I suppose. Okay. If not, I will. Oh, there you go. Okay, I just need the to know who's going in first. Yes. Yeah. Okay, um... Not a trap. Definitely not a trap. <laughs> Can you please give me a dexterity saving throw? <laughs> Mom? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I offered, then you offered. Cool. Uh, you you don't take any damage if that makes you feel any better, but you definitely know that this guy just tried to cast Sacred Flame on you. And everybody can go ahead and roll me for initiative. I guess I gotta move my pug to somewhere I know I'd be, so it'd probably be back there. Yes, sir. Ooh. Ooh, come on, baby. I'll take it. Ooh. <laughs> That's why I wait now. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like... Well, so Dante and I are going... <laughs> first as fuck. No. I'm going first. You are going behind me. Is the way it should be. For now. I can do the door. So right? we, we, we've clearly seen this man just yeah. throw a fireball. Okay. No, no, he threw up. He he casted sacred flame, which is completely okay. different. Because yes, yes. Fire, fireball, everyone sad, everyone dead. I get that. <laughs> Probably. Fireball at this level would be TPK. Yeah, I know, because I was denied Schmitty and his fireball, but that's a different story. I remember Smitty. I do too. I kind of wish I'd forget him, but yeah. <laughs> you made him. He was your character. Yeah, that was my first character. Aww. Baby's first uh, character. Fond memories. <laughs> yeah, we were trying to hold this dude, correct? Well, you're trying to get information from him, yes. Okay. I guess uh how um, are the how are the dudes around us looking? Are they are they like drawing swords and shit? No. The brother reassured us that or reassured them that nothing we're not gonna do anything wrong. Yeah, but then this guy just fucking uh, sacred flamed us. Yes, but to be honest, you haven't done anything yet. Mm-hmm. So I'm assuming it is my turn. Um, yes. you are not yeah. on my initiative, Tracker dear. He rolled twenty five. Oops. I can fix that. <clears throat> you are now. I didn't hear anything, Maddie. I missed everything. I lost this sound for a bit. Uh, roll for initiative, Mom. I but did you're, that. You're here. Then you're good. We haven't done anything more yet. Okay. Uh, what's the brother's name? Uh, Thirstwell. Thirstwell? Yes. Okay. Seems like what Molly does every week. Damn. Not wrong. No. I didn't I deny it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that Molly's First just like, I'm not well. denying. I'm not denying. <laughs> but I'm not saying it. Frosty's so thirsty. So, 
So what's going on? Sorry, you want to forget. Um, Jordy, why do you get a plus one? That, isn't that what the thing says? Am I looking at the wrong thing? What thing? Oh no, I looked it up online. I just typed it in. What? What? It's one plus strength modifier, isn't it? Yes, but not to attack. That's a d20, dear. Oh, mm, did not know that. Um, but your damage is one plus your strength modifier, so okay. you're good otherwise. Okay, okay, okay. Wait. Sorry! No, you're good, you're good, but you were also proficient in it, so there you go. Oh, so yeah. I mean, who's not proficient in fighting with their fists, let's be honest. Um, <clears throat> especially in fantasy land. Um, alright. Dante, you're up first, dear. Excellent. So, I'm assuming I hear... I hear the kerfuffle going off. Uh, yeah. I mean, he wasn't really too quiet about casting Sacred Flame. Yeah. So I turn around, turn to the guard there, like, so my friends are going to go in there, and they're probably going to attack him or do something to him. Are we going to be attacked if this is the case? Because he just attacked us. Between you and me, they don't pay us enough. <laughs> Perfect. I end my turn. Sorry, let me let me rephrase. They don't pay us enough for us to care. Perfect. Even better. I end my turn. Emirate. Emirate's gonna stride forward. Uh, let's see. Try to get in that corner right there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and uh, they're gonna they're gonna hold their attack action for uh, and just say, uh, "We have." Or no, no, no. They're gonna say, "We we need information, and you and you know." Uh, where you know what we need to know, so we can do this the easy way. And that's when I hold my attack check action, or the hard way. Okay, so what's the trigger for your uh, attack the trigger, action? The trigger will be um, if they don't if they don't share uh, information with before the end of my turn. Before, before the before, end before of the beginning turn. of my next before the beginning of my next turn. Okay. Sorry. Um. All right. Uh, it call. Uh. Mm, I'm just gonna make this. See if I can make this as quick as possible. I'm just gonna wait. Do 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 do. Cool. I'm gonna. Uh, we'll we'll say jog. I'll jog up to the the kind <laughs> gentleman. Right here. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna hit him with an unarmed strike. Sure, you're gonna give me a wisdom save first. Wait, what? <laughs> not me. Uh, yep. saving wisdom throw, save, correct? Please. Yes, please. That's not good. So, oh. here's what it is. After he casted Sacred Flame, he casted Sanctuary on himself. Okay. So... On a failed save, the creature must choose a new target or lose the attack or spell. Nice. So, you don't have another target to attack, so you have lost your attack. Can I action search? I, do you still have it? Uh, it doesn't re. No, we took a short rest while we waited. Right? When? When we were saying, did we say we didn't take a short rest when uh, we chilled with the brother? No. Yeah. No. Oh, okay, never mind. I don't have it. Uh, you did not. We leveled. We're not max health. Uh, okay. Yep, 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 yep. I remember. It all comes back to me. Uh, God, when do I get my second time in this class? <laughs> uh, can I just like. You know what? No, that's fine. It's like, ah, oh, I, I tried being nice. 
Can't say the rest from our friends, and I'll I'll pass to him. Comfort. Hey. Okay. Um. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Move. Move. Thanks. Um. I am gonna cast hold person on him, since that's not a harmful spell. No, it is not. Wisdom save. Yes. DC fourteen. Oh, it's next level. So he can't move because he he rolled a one. Nice. <laughs> Rip. But I mean, what do you expect, honestly, from a man who <laughs> looks like this? I see. He does. He does. It's in the the Discord chat. Sorry. Does it? He's ugly. Mm -hmm. Whoa, judgy. He's tall, though, so he could be a jack with flesh. Um, Comfort, what else are you going to do? Your whole person successfully went off. (laughs) <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah we just we just want to talk that's all I'm just gonna I'm just gonna concentrate on my spell okay and those who well, want to ask so the questions with hold person he can try again at the end of his turn yes yeah okay because it's his turn mm-hmm. um and he is going to attempt again you said DC was 14 It's okay, he failed again. Um, <clears throat> however, does a 16 hit you, Comfort? Yeah. Okay, um, and I need a constitution saving throw from you, please. Okay. Ah. Oh. How much HP do you have left? 17. Okay. Uh, you're going to take you 13 damage total, and I need you to give me a con- another constitution saving throw to maintain hold person. Uh, with the DC to beat being 10. Hold person drops. Crystar. That is unfortunate. Yes, that demonic shit sixes. going on here. <laughs> Coach, I'm like this. I am going to move forward. So I'm within 10 feet of him. Mm-hmm. I'm going to, as a bonus action, utter vow of enmity. Can't even pronounce that. Enmity. Thank you. And then the man. And. Uh, okay. No, I've got to come closer. I'm gonna come up. Can I come up over here? So I've got advantage. I've got advantage. You've already got advantage anyway. Exactly. What was the point of using your channel divinity? Extra advantage. (laughs) No, I I thought. Anyways, never mind. To prove a point. It is clearly to prove a point. Are you going to attack him? Yes. You're going to give me a wisdom save first. 13. Hang on. I knew oh. it was the case with Jordy. Well, meets it, beats it. How? Oh, Jesus Christ. And the 10 hits him. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow. So, oh. Oh, Mom, boy. I want you to know that this man does not have a lot of HP. Okay. I guess I should have talked to him first. Shit. At maximum, he has 12. Oh, shit. Say, there's a reason I didn't go in with the great sword on that scene. <laughs> Someone was paying attention. <laughs> uh, so, hold up. You've, um... Hold up. 
I'm oh still, no! I, I still have it. What? Oh. Uh, I'm gonna pop my cloud rune. I'm gonna redirect the attack to myself. Hey. I got a question. Can we direct partial damage or is it all the damage? All damage. Uh. Cause I have a feeling this man's gonna die if I don't. So. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay. You know what? Jordy, it will consume your reaction to do so. Is that acceptable yeah. for you? That, that works cool. with me. So, Kaiser, you go to take the swing, and you're like, no, this will be fine. He looks sturdier than he appears. <laughs> this is fine. Where the fuck is my sister, you lily-livered shit? Mm -hmm. um, however, since Ikal is standing right behind him, and he can see how much this man is basically just quaking in his boots, stuck between the six foot. Wait, how tall is Akal? Uh, I think he's just six foot. And how tall is Kaistar? Oh, Kaistar is only <laughs> um five six. So caught between super armored woman swinging a sword at him and then super armored man standing behind him. Uh, Ikal reaches out and kind of just blocks your shot with his arm. And then the man kind of just drops the thing that's in his hands and puts his hands up in surrender because good god, no. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, so, uh... Thank you, Akal. I, I let my anger that he attacked us first get ahead of me. I thank you. We need okay. answers from this prick. That's okay, just... I mean, talk. Just over here there, with my crossbow like that. I'd that talk way. if I were you. <clears throat> well, uh, it's truly dependent on what you wish to know. Whether or not I am able to assist you at all. Um, well, who looked at the drawing that Adira had made? Uh, I did. Okay. Uh, Kaistar, the box that he dropped looks suspiciously like one of the box, like the, one of the drawings that Adira made. I call Adira over and point it out to her. I'm not ready to touch it just yet. It is the exact drawing that you made, Adira. Uh, it's like at the end of his bed. Here. No, you can't have it. Uh, uh I can I just remove my uh, it. yeah, I can remove my friend's hand from here and uh, just let them go. Keep swinging. You know what? On second thought, it's all yours. Okay, uh, you have found yourself. It appears to be a cube. Um, sorry. Hang on. You I'm just trying say. to. I shut up. <laughs> <laughs> This cube is one, made of cubes. One cube. <laughs> Congratulations, you have a block of dirt from Minecraft. <laughs> no, I no. Don't. You just dirt. place it down. So this is a cube-shaped container. Um, that's five inches by five inches. Composed of airtight interlocking parts made from materials found somewhere that you're not familiar with. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is a puzzle box. Does this uh, question mark stuff look like metal or anything, or what? It does. Okay. But you don't know what kind of metal. Yeah, I, I get that. I'm just curious. What's that? You say this thing looks like bones or something. This man's about to eat this box. 
Yeah, so no bones for you. Not allowed. No, I don't. I've been trying to figure it out. Oh, it was given to me. By who? Uh <laughs> um. <laughs> the unblinking, the unblinking direct eye contact, like that gets really creepy after about like ten minutes. <laughs> it was a man named Thavius Krieg. Well, uh, write that, please. My mother convinced him to let us keep it for him. Um, and yes, Savius. Where where is Savius? Savius. Oh my God, T H A, please, Savius. Wow, I spelled it wrong. I, I heard an S. I heard an F. I heard a D. Thaddeus. <laughs> no, you are hearing what you want to hear, Molly. <laughs> you can't. It, it all it basically tells you is that this is the right one. It shows it opening. Start playing with it? Great. Roll me an investigation check. At disadvantage, because you don't fucking know what you're doing. Not terrible. And this is how we die. <laughs> you just just by playing with it, you have gotten further than he has. Just like uh, in so much, in so much as you've managed to. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so I fucking love it. So much. Have you ever seen like I did? Oh. A no, I'm sorry. Um, can you give me a wisdom saving throw, please? Meanwhile, Dante's still outside talking to the guards. Yeah. <laughs> you, you just had to say, oh, I love puzzles. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. No. No. Q, Q, I you have to ask. Off. We do the crosswords every Sunday. How much HP does Adira have? Did you just straight out? Did you just straight out kill her? <laughs> I'm I may not have missed you with death. <gasps> no. Okay, so you uh, have to do. You have to do. You have thirty-five. It's not an attack. You have thirty-five health. So you need seventy. All right. Seventy You're in kill. luck. You're in luck. Oh. You're standing with one HP. And you're getting the idea that maybe you should stop playing with the box. The box. <laughs> um, does, does Kaisar see that you've done this, right? Yeah, it's... Honestly, I Step over. No, 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 hang on, Mom. You don't notice anything's wrong except for a very small trickle of blood coming down Adira's nose. Adira, are you okay? <laughs> okay. Uh, 
And I'm going to cast Cure Wounds at second level. Uh, I'm heading over to Lay on Hands, so... God. Every... Everybody's touching Adira. Must uh-huh. they just stumble upon, like, the oh my god, wait, no. configuration or something? In, re- um, <laughs> in reality... Adira, you're healed for 20. In reality, all you guys see is a nosebleed, and all you've done is just rush towards a nosebleed. Yes. Because yeah. the deer is so nice. Just the sound of her voice. I knew there was something wrong. <laughs> oh, I love it. <sighs> <laughs> That's right, because you're wearing white! <laughs> <laughs> Icky, ewy, gross, bloody. <laughs> Uh-oh, so, spaghettios. Yeah. You're... You're... Yeah. Um, Okay. <laughs> You guys are insane. Uh, do you have any more questions for him? Uh, yeah. Don't forget that little four. So I turned to him. And I look at him and I said, <clears throat> your imps report to you of what's going on in the town, correct? Yes. Have you seen someone that looks exactly like me? No, I've seen you. No, 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 no. This is the first time you've met me. No, That's it's my not. Sister. You walked into the bathhouse yesterday. Idiot. Right. Before right. that. And Comfort. be careful. I can still Comfort. use my sword. Molly, you were saying something. Sorry, what was it? No, it's dumb. <laughs> just, my, just my conspiracy theory. I'm literally like back here with my board with all the strings through it like <laughs> listen guys <laughs> where you were you were at the bathhouse did you say no, no his my... imps were the, okay that's what i thought but no my conspiracy I, theory went why would i leave this manor that seems like a very stupid thing to do do <laughs> you know what they do at I, that bathhouse I, I wouldn't be so cocky Before the bathhouse. Look, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't follow every single person that lives in Baldur's Gate. Amaret? Yes? When did the building fall? I'm pretty sure you would have recognized that. DM, when did the building fall? Like a few, uh, like weeks before, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, About a few weeks ago. You know, and who said that building. had anything to do with me? I didn't say it had to do with you. I just thought you'd know about it. It's something big that's happened in the town. A lot of things happen in this town, lady. I keep track of the ones that are important to my family. May I? Dealing with I somebody sniffing around isn't my job. Left that to Mortlock. She just looks at him and walks away. May I inside check him, DM? Sure. <laughs> nope. He's telling the truth. Okay. Sure. Oh, it was psychic damage. And you only know that? You only know that because of all the time you spent with Oldran. Yeah. <laughs> Your brain's super tingly right now. Like, and it's worse because you've just had a mystic vision. Oh. Like, so it's one of those, you're going to have a persistent headache for the next, like, three days. And there's nothing you can do about it. That's my mom's name. Comfort and patience. Right now? What? No, a uh, patience. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of name is right now. It's obviously. I don't patient. know what kind of name is comfort. Beside, beside the point. My mom picked it out for me, so. <laughs> <laughs> the job.
on, m'lady. My mommy, so yeah. shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Well, she convinced him to turn it over to her. And then she gave it to me. No. I wasn't so foolish as to try and push the... You tried sliding it open! This is an infernal puzzle box! Infernal puzzle box! You absolute me- Nathandral! Which Can means, I? in case you are unaware, that if you do something wrong while trying to open it, it's gonna hurt. Him before I we leave. He's annoying. Look at Amor. <laughs> Please remember, this man does not have a lot of health. Mm. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Anybody gonna ask him where his mother is? Since that was the fucking reason y'all came in here. I was giving permission to hit him. <laughs> we'll come back to you. We'll come back to you. A call. Can I hit him? <laughs> Subtle Go ahead. ahead. What are you hitting? I mean, yeah, you just you cuff yeah. this guy upside the back oh. of the head. Neat. Eight more health to go. <laughs> <laughs> Jordy, no! <laughs> You've got two more slaps. It's infernal. an infernal puzzle box. Mm -hmm. Which, given what he's told you, leads you to believe that it's made from infernal iron. Such as originating from a layer of hell. Jordy, are you gonna ask him anything, or are you just gonna cuff him upside the back of the head? Because uh, that's acceptable too. No, I'm. I'm just. I'm here for uh, making sure he complies. That's it. Okay. I'm gonna slowly walk up, seeing that no one's asked the questions, <laughs> the relevant question. No offense. Uh, do you know where where your mother is by chance? She's under the manor with Savius Creek. Interesting. Not really. Okay, thank you. That was easy. Are they doing anything in particular, or are they just... there? I don't know. I don't typically go down there. Okay. Bring him like we've got his brother. Probably not. I don't think we'd get anything off of him anyway. Yeah, but the mother might be willing to deal for both of them. I barely want to do this. I barely want to have this guy in the way we have him. And this is just, this one's just necessity. I'd rather not do more kidnapping. Let's go, with do, let's go with let's go with what we have. Uh, a call. We're we're good. All right, I'm gonna hit him Stop one more time. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I'm slapping him upside the head one more time. <laughs> okay. Uh, you do you you hit him hard enough to 
just render him unconscious. Okay. Which, I mean, really does not take much. Wait, wait. Can I open this chest? <laughs> Amaranth's gonna walk before he starts with that fucking looting. <laughs> there is a padlock on the chest. I have a sword. <laughs> Remember the last time you chest. tried to use it? Fine. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's a padlock on the chest. Does this body over here have the key? I. Uh, you can. Definitely search him. Yo, oh, I don't want to touch him. He's unconscious. I knocked him unconscious. To an unconscious body, <laughs> hand it over. Yes, he's been he's been knocked unconscious. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I'm taking his chest. Yeah. It, it weighs fifty pounds. For the record. <laughs> And you're going to cart this thing around with you. Can I push this over? I want to be petty. <laughs> yes! Okay. This I'll is a train that. wreck, and I love it. I want you yeah. to know that. I'm pushing that thing over. <laughs> the pet bed? No, no, this, this... no it's, a, it's a bathtub. I'm pushing okay. the bathtub. You'll never have water for an hour. Okay. Yeah. Real times. He oh. lives in his parents' <laughs> basement. You know, we never leave. This is the second floor. Mm -hmm. Well, close enough. <laughs> they are. Let's no. go. Do you, don't you ever feel like you want to wake up and just yas queen yourself into the bath? <laughs> <laughs> All the time, honey. So, I I do want you guys to know that you've knocked out the guy who could have told you how to get downstairs. I'll steal his body too, God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're taking his chest uh, and throwing him over your shoulder. Yeah, uh, I'll. Mm, mm, do we? Uh, do we want to take him with us? When you have somebody who could open the chest. Oh yeah, I don't think, nah, I don't think Dante would do it. I mean, you could just ask him. The worst he'll say is no. Yeah. Puck my head out. Dante, you want to get some loot? I'm still talking to him. <laughs> I'm right. talking to the guards there. I'm just, that's right. how you catch the fish with your hands. It's perfect. <laughs> you ever done that before? <laughs> they, 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 are, they are enjoying this lively conversation with Dante. Yeah. Um, and, Jordy, when you poke your head out to ask, Mm -hmm. Um, they inform you, oh no, he's got the key, and they actually point at the guard that stands outside his door, uh -huh. and the guard just procures the key. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Okay. You don't get this for free. I got an unconscious body in the room. You know that? No, I really don't. <laughs> Much I prefer figured. something of monetary value if you catch my drift. This close? <laughs> I... No, no, no. Uh, I'll throw... I have what? I'll throw a gold piece out of my not. Cool. Sure. And he just hands the key over. No more questions. All right. No uh, more arguments. You're what a really good chest? guard. What part of they don't pay us enough to care did you miss? Then do you know where the mother, their mother is? Nope. We guard this floor, and this floor only. How do we go to the basement, then? Or to the next layer, layer, level, sorry. That's not till later. <laughs> uh, might be off the kitchen. Perhaps down in a pantry. Thank you. Though, if they ask, do you say that you had to actually beat the information out of us? Do you of want course. me to touch you with my knife? I would really prefer if you didn't. Perfect. See? If that's I mean, all the same to you. Life proof always made things go better when you lied to the people anyway. I mean, yes, but I like all of my bits in the right places. 
I just said cut. I didn't mean to cut off things. You know, a little thing under the eye. Made you look good, brings you all the ladies. <laughs> I, I don't think Or that's men, me. if you swing the other way. I, I mean, I swing both ways, but that's besides the point. Um, Bisexual icon. No. <laughs> I don't think Dante's cut out to be a dating advisor. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Dante's the Cut best out. one for dating advice. Cut out. I could just imagine Adira try following me as she's trying to butt in or try to uh, not butt in. Uh, excuse, word, me, but... uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. Excuse <laughs> me. <laughs> Her hands were like folded like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, dear. And I just pat her on the head. <laughs> How tall is Adira? Oh. <laughs> yeah, How tall I'm... is Dante when he stands up? If I'm full? Yeah. Uh, let me... uh, yeah, I'm 6'2 as well. <laughs> I'm, I'm usually hunched because, well, yeah. obvious, but... Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Something's wrong here. What did you what did you want to say? The invisibility? Of, of course. Why not? Perfect. Pockets in a hen house. Did uh, you ever find out if you're going to get rid of... Bye. Okay. <laughs> Jordy. Wait, Jordy. Wait. Just go take it. I'm, I'm here. I'm waiting for you to... to okay. Open. Go ahead. Okay. Open the fucking chest. Because okay, you have the, the key. Wait, did you knock him out? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this guy has information. Why do you knock him out? We got most of it. Jordy. Yes. Inside the chest... You find a jumble of wrinkled garments, red wax candles, quills, blank parchments of paper, uh, and jars of ink. It also holds an unlocked wooden coffer containing 73 gold pieces. There we go. 120 silver pieces and a potion of healing, as well as a black covered tome entitled Apopolyptico. Uh, a poetry prophecy by an unknown author envisioning the end of the multiverse. I'll hang on to that, Tom. What's I'll hang the name on to of the it again? Apocalyptico. Uh. Apocalyptico. What not a movie? Uh, no. Maybe. And uh, I'm going to also hang on to the paper and the ink, because I figured Adira might need some more in case they have another... <laughs> Brain hemorrhage? Sure, yeah. Anyway, I'll do the last thing. I'll put this in his bed. I'll tuck him in. Whoops. Okay. Okay, so walking out. Mm-hmm. And so I'm curious the comfort see all this go down. Probably. Yeah, and that's how we keep money in the bank, comfort. What the fuck? <laughs> What's a bank? <laughs> so, Me. uh, as you're stepping out of the room, yes. the guard holds his hand out for the key for a moment, mm-hmm. locks the door behind you, and hands it back. 
There you go. Once Actually, everybody's you know out of the room. Uh, right. I'm, I'm going to throw him my six more gold pieces. Like, thank you for your business. Okay. Um, matter of fact, the guards then look at Amric. Do you want us to deal with him for you? <laughs> no. Yes. Yes. I, I, I don't think they mean that. You know, um, just put a good word in with us. We're with the iron, the flaming fist for us. Rather not get caught up in the cleaning house, as it were. There's two different ways we could go to go about this. So you're telling me that he's been nothing but useful to you. So, why he does his... he smell like the inside of a wine barrel? Hmm. Yeah. Well, we had to move him from place to place without anyone seeing And you did it in a wine barrel. You, you know what? I'm going to throw two more gold mm -hmm. at this guy. But I no more questions. <laughs> <laughs> he is his mother's favorite. We may need him for... No, 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 don't say anymore. No, yep, no, yep. no, 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 no. Yeah, no, the less we know, the better. No. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go, people, let's go. Wait, <laughs> so where is the mother? In the basement. Off we're of going the kitchen, to, maybe. We're going to check the kitchen, supposedly. Wait, you don't know where the basement is? We don't know how to get to the basement. How about just then why did you not get the person who knew where the basement was? <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> Damn. Alright. Sure, no, I'm a giant didn't over there. Stop him either. I was a I Not you. It was not I my was turn in, this, in the turn order. <laughs> <laughs> um Okay. Go get him. Wake him up. So that way we can go. Uh yeah. about the way. I swear yeah. this is what I have to deal with. They just kind of reach out and gently just pat you on the shoulder. Like, it's okay. Thank we you. We understand. Thank you. I want to take you for a beer later. <laughs> yeah? Not that kind of beer, but beer. <laughs> 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 All right, <sorry. laughs> well, if you survive whatever it is that's down there. Wait, the cat might know. Uh, <laughs> I'll be at the uh, Elf Song Tavern every night for a week. Good. That's where I stay. Perfect. Good luck. You're getting the ins distinct impression that he may still try for more than just that beer. He's gonna get a knife if he tries. But, <laughs> <laughs> but he also seems to know that if you say no when it comes down to it, and you're not in the middle of a potentially life-threatening situation, that he's just going to back off. It's one of those, like, it just may not be the time to be flirting with the guy that's currently invading the house that I'm supposed to be protecting. <laughs> Professional courtesy. Yeah. Yeah. We have but, those, you know. But happens. also... But, all, well, yeah, but no, no, like, these guards could just be like, nah, fuck you. But he's also just like, yeah, no, like, I'm yeah. technically still on the clock here. Yes. But yeah, also one of those, if I don't shoot my shot, I may never get a chance to. Yeah. <laughs> e Ekal, yep. get, get the brother. We are going to wake him up. Then what we are going to do is get the information we need. Don't knock him out again. Please. Why did you even attack him in the first place? Yes, he threw things at us, but we are better than this. Are we? I am. I, I, I still like this asking the cat idea. <laughs> um, yeah, actually, maybe you should ask the cat. I so cast I speak with you. animals. <laughs> ask the cat. Of course you have that spell. 
I've used it. Of course I, I do. Yep. On Cos, what? Cos the the rat? On the rat yeah. in the sewer. Oh, that's right. Okay. That is right. Yeah. So can it's I do possible, animal yeah. handling to help? Very <laughs> good. I mean, there's really... It, it's no automatic. Help. It doesn't yeah, really do Yeah, it's automatic. But all you're hearing is this, like, growling, hissing exchange between the cat and Comfort. Oh, hey, what's well, up, friends? Yeah. <laughs> what are you going to ask? The main level. Hello, kitty. Um, we need <laughs> some assistance. And I was wondering, I, I can promise you all the, the delicious, like, Rushes. fresh fish that you want, if you can tell us how to get to the basement. If you know. <clears throat> well, for starters... The cat talks my about name is my not mind. Kitty. I literally just looked this up. My name is Slobber Chops. <laughs> I would appreciate if you used it. I like this dude already. Uh, Slobber Chops? You heard me. Okay, well, that's, that's a very distinguished name. Um... Please, Mr. Slobber Chops. Will you? Oh no. Show us if you know how to get to the basement. We were told it was in the kitchen. Maybe? It's off the kitchen. Well. In the pantry. Oh. But yes, I can show you. Alright. Lead the way. Slobber Chops. <laughs> That's actually what this cat's name is. I say in um, common, the cat's fucking name is Slobber Chop. Who names their fucking <laughs> cat Slobber Chops? It's his name. <laughs> anyway. Well, no, this is his human name. Mm hmm. Because the cat name we can't understand. <laughs> cats have three names. Yeah. <laughs> because old, cats fun, have three fun, names. Fun. <laughs> The heavy side layer? Is that, is that how it Yeah, goes? yeah, something like yeah, that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> um, yeah, uh, he leads you downstairs to, uh, so if you guys head back over to the map, to the room that you found, or to the left side of the map, to the kitchen where you had found slobber chops to begin with, um, and there's a door right here. Also, real quick, uh, I just want to say you're welcome. So, yeah. Give me Four. one second. Oh, just gave you the idea to talk to the cat. <laughs> You're also the person who knocked out the man we had all the information with. Uh, yes, thank you. I love expending spell slots to talk to animals because we knocked out people who have you, information. You, thank you. You, <laughs> you, thank don't, you were in the room, Comfort. You could have You don't also get the asked. dust. You were, you were in the room. What do you mean? Comfort, comfort, I held comfort. him in place to make sure he wouldn't escape. Comfort, his name's Slobber Chops. That's already worth it. <laughs> He's my pet. This is what I have to so, deal with. The door opens, um, and this room contains a barrel of fresh water and a brick walled staircase that descends 15 feet. The next map. And if we have everybody up, which we don't. You're missing Adira? Are you no, you're missing Emirate. Um oh. are you taking Emric down with you or are you letting the guards deal with him? Emrek are coming with us. Mm-hmm. Okay. They didn't say they were gonna kill him. Mm -mm. Didn't say they were gonna kill him. No, our, our, our safe in the hole with the mother. Okay. I missed that, sorry. Uh, you, you will find yourselves 
right side-ish of the map. You may have to, like, zoom all the way out to find yourself. Oh, there we go. Try that. Right side, middle. Oh, wow. Yeah. We were out there. Just a second. <sighs> yep, there we are. Cool. Everything's, um, my thing is not responding, Maddie. Give me a minute. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll show back here. All right, come on. Chrome's not responding. Oh, no, that's just unfortunate. It, yeah. This weekend, I'm going to bring the uh, Alienware up here and get it set up. I've had enough. But hey, you haven't had to switch off Discord on your laptop. No, no, that works fine, but I st I've, I've got to get off D&D &D Beyond. It's not loading. Okay. That you guys are down here. Let me. I'll listen. You may have to move my character for a bit. So. Yep. Feel this. Okay. <clears throat> Four stone pillars brace the ten foot high vaulted ceiling of this dry cellar. The walls of which are lined with a dozen barrels on wooden braces. Half the barrels have brass spigots tapped into them. The room also contains two stacks of wooden crates, one in the middle of the room and another by the south wall. That's what you see when you enter this room. There is a doorway to the left and a doorway to the right. Uh, You're invisible, yes, Dante? Hi. Sorry, I just want to... Sneaky, sneaky. I'm taking both course of actions to let Dante investigate. However, um, as you guys walk forward, uh, three spined devils burst from the crates. I guess I have to make a uh, stealth check, don't I? You're invisible. They didn't react to you. I mean... I'm gonna let, you know... Be, being invisible, being invisible doesn't up, make me not here. noisy. Mm -hmm. No, but they're bursting out of the crates, creating enough noise that they wouldn't hear you anyway. Okay, cool. Just... So, go ahead and roll for initiative, guys. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Come on. Did not roll? Same. Yeah, oh, yep. Okay. D&D &D Beyond, or...? D&D &D Beyond. 20. Okay. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. It was slow and it was shitty. I hate this. Yep. 10 by 14. <laughs> yeah. Rip. Oh, change it over. Is what it is. Okay. All right. Is that everybody? One, two. Uh, Adira, you're up first. Mm -hmm. Do it. Um, very smart. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it does hit hit them. I was like, was I smart and already set this shit up? I was. I busted my butt. Everything is all set up in this and ready to go. I shouldn't have to oh, do geez. anything. 
Jeez, fatty. Take it. Sorry about that. Not gay headache. There it goes. It's okay. We'll take the first one. Anything else? Okay. Um, it is this one's turn. And the first attack against you has disadvantage. Okay. It is. Roll 20 is now being laggy for me as well. Mm-hmm. But, like, it's not lagging enough mm. to drop us from the server. It's just lagging on inputting roles. Well, I tried to kick it my, my um, okay. character sheet over to the other computer, and it wouldn't let me, so. It's also Chrome. Uh, 16 misses you, yes? Okay. Kystar, you're up. Mm-hmm. All right, so I'm going to move to here. I have my shield up, so I am going, um, as a bonus mark, I'm going to cast Hunter's Mark on the one in front of me. Okay. And I'm going to attack him with my longsword. 15? Yes, ma'am. Uh, there we go, and then Hunter's Mark. Come on, click on you. Yeah, it's really slow. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. It's not Zoom, it's Roll20. Technical difficulties, ladies and gents. And yeah. unfortunately, both of them were out of our control. Mm -hmm. All right. I clicked it twice, so it may take, it may, there we go. So, two, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Nine points of damage. Anything else, Bob? No, that's it. The one that's right in front of you. Yeah, so ignore the second one. Yep. Uh, 13 misses you, yes? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm 19. Um... Q? Um, what's that? Why are you rolling for Kystar? <laughs> and you rolled with Beyond 20. Okay. Uh, Dante, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm it's a paladin class feature. Sorry, don't take go ahead. What are you doing? Cool. I'm just gonna step off to the side over here. Just lean my back. <laughs> lean my back on the wall. Kick a leg up. Just watch the ensuing action. Excellent. Um, Adira. As I'm going to attempt to continue to hit you and attempt to patiently wait for... Oh, good! One of them went through. It's a nat 20. Um, you're going to take seven piercing damage total as it pierces you with the fork in its hands. Seven. And then the other attack misses you. Comfort. Hmm. Um, all right, I will walk up to the creatures and I will, I will, hopefully, because they're devil creatures, I will start speaking infernal to them. Okay. And I will say, fellas, or ladies, whichever. Well, we don't need to. We don't need to fight here, right? Like we can just be civil about this. And uh, I want to cast Charm Person at second level to try and get just the the middle one and the one closer to me to try and like trust me. 
Okay. Um, We're not trying to disturb anything. We just want to be on our way. They inform you that it's part of the contract that they're... Because they were summoned. Like, they're, they're summoned devils. So they have to follow the rules of the one who summoned them. Me too. Yes, so, or die. Yeah, oh everybody's boy. coming back oh. in now. Yep. I haven't. I'm still in. Well, aren't you just special? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm the is. one standing by and watching. <laughs> um, <laughs> That's what so, you get for being invisible. Comfort, these things tell you that they have to follow the, like, they have to follow the orders. And, I mean, the orders involve them being able to rip and tear, so why wouldn't they? You can't just look the other way for a little bit. We can freaking throw you some some gold if that's what you want. No. We want to rip and tear. So that's what we're going to do. No, oh, well, that's just great. I'm just, I, I want to save you from using your spell slot here. So what are you doing? Unless you actually want to go through with using Charm Person on these two. Mm, I guess I won't. Um, well, then I kind of forgot everybody that's around me. Turn order, because I... D or not d and Beyond. Roll 20 is not letting me back in. Um, I'll just look over... And Adira, because I remember she was next to me. Yes. And I will, I will sing. Uh, our whole group went wild. As I held my breath, the world said still, but still she just smiled. I was in the seventh heaven when I blessed the preacher. And you get bardic inspiration. Just in case. Thanks, I know. Am I better now? Um. <laughs> nope, still a D6. Hey, call. Hmm. Let's see, let's see. So we're trying to charm these two. That didn't work. Uh, if I plug this up correctly... Yeah, I can still get that being a problem. Kind of comfort is I had negotiations go. Alright, I'm just going to swing. <laughs> what? Sorry. <laughs> oh. Sorry, my dog's barking, so. <laughs> All good. Say it again. I was saying, how do negotiations go here? Oh, well, mm, they kind of don't want to listen. Okay. And, uh, so, uh, have at it, fam. Okay, I already hit the hit button, but it's not popping. Just give it, give it a second. Things are just being slow tonight. Yo. Kind of ruins the pacing, but I mean, gotta do what we're gonna do. We're doing it live. Yep. Uh, the uh, 11 won't hit him, though. But I'm gonna quickly refresh, so I'll be right back. I will also refresh. Mm -hmm. Oh boy.
So the 11 doesn't hit, Jordy. Is there anything uh, else that you'd like to do? Nope. Okay, Emirate. Emirate is uh, just popping with the, uh, this one right here by comfort and a call with the hand crossbow. And because I took crossbow expert, uh, I will do it twice. As soon as it loads. Well, I'm going to just fire twice. Cause that's what I was going to do anyway. So, a 24 and whatever the next one's going to be. But 24? Yeah, that'll hit. Okay. And then a 9 misses, I guess. No, the 9 won't hit. Okay. <sighs> Me looking at it, I know I clicked on it, but I want to click on it again. Does it have a tag? No. Oh, damn. Unless you want it to die. No, I don't. That's why I put him in the corner. Okay, there it is. Uh, you ten total. have. You have, um, the curse the, active, yes? Like the... Uh, the right, yeah, it stays up. It stays up now. Until I, it stays up until I take a short rest. Or until I take a rest. Okay. It is balanced because I keep the damage, I think. Yeah, no, that's fine. Um... Anything else, Decca? Uh, no, that's it. Okay, and back to the top of the round, Adira. Mm -hmm. There you go. Beats it, beats it. Well, I'm glad everyone's having the same problems I am. Yeah, tonight it's just a... It is just an unfortunate lag issue. I have a feeling it's on Roll20 then, because it's happening for everybody. Who's missing out of um, Roll20? I'm stuck in loading, apparently. Yeah. Com I'm Nicole. also still stuck in loading. Yeah, I was going to say, because I'm missing... Kate, anything else, Adira? Okay. Just once in front of comfort. Um. Oh, boy, this kills pacing. Um. Mm -hmm. It really does. Do we want to take a break and see if it gets, gets caught up? You know what? Does everybody have access to their dice? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Go get your dice. It's right in oh, front of me. Boy. Always ready. Always ready. Uh, Fuck it. V We're doing it live. V can roll for me. I don't have dice. <laughs> what? Why don't you have dice? I only have D6s and a spin down. I play magic, leave oh. me alone. What if you play magic in 7020? Yeah, it's a spin down, it's not true. I think we're gonna have to fix that. I think so too. Jordy, when this is all over, we're going to Alien World. Hey, yep, so I'd rather just go to Night, uh, night Watch. Can you, uh, can you just go send me watch. some money so I can buy some resin? Because I got those dice molds here and I'll just make Jordy a set of dice? Yeah, mm. we can do that. Excellent. Down the road. <laughs> Yeah, you never sh- uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Wait, uh, why Jordy, am I grabbing I have dice? seven. <laughs> Jordy. Right Jordy. 
Jordy, yeah, you're being told to pick which dice. Uh, uh, purple and gold. Purple and gold. I have blue. And gold. Yeah, these are my dice right here. Yeah, look at them. Look at them. <laughs> <laughs> You're already playing cards here. I know. Alright. Again. It's an Oath of Vengeance spell. It's by yeah. Oath of Vengeance. And why is it the thing? Yeah. It, yeah. I forgot it too, so don't feel so bad. After I leveled up. Okay. So, we need to do this. So, the one that is in front of comfort. Yes? Yes. Misses. That attack. And... Um, does a 16 hit you, Comfort? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh, you are going to take a grand total of two damage. Oh. Oh, no. That's still as, not good. <laughs> as it bites you. Nomity nom nom nom. Ow. Um, Kaistar, you're up. 16 plus 7 is 20... Yes! <laughs> Bitch. Uh, 7 plus 5, 11 damage. Okay. Oh, right. Plus the 1d6. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Plus another 6. Okay. Anything else, Kaistar? Nope. Well, it's the one that's in front of you's turn. Cool. Uh, and he misses that attack. Uh, does a 17 hit you? Nope. I misses with that one, too. Dante, are you doing anything? Or are you I'm just gonna maintain your... I'm lighting up a quiet... smoke. <laughs> I'm lighting up a smoke. Okay. I'm... Yeah, it would. Yeah, I'm, I'm attacking my lungs. Everybody, everybody <laughs> just smells the, the beautiful scent of Dante's pipe, but... That is a beautiful smell. It really is. It was one of my favorite things about hanging out with Uncle Bob because he smokes a yep. pipe. Um, or Harvey. So, the uh, the one that is in front of Adira um, does a 21 hit you. Cool. Six and C4. Oh, is there anything I can help? Mm, shit. Uh, you were going to take Five and two. Seven damage total. Uh, Comfort, you're up. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm. S there's still one right in front of me, right? Yep. Oh yeah. All three of them are still up. All right. Well then, I am going to let's burn that last second level spell slot, and I will cast. Uh, dissonant Whispers at level 2 okay. on the one in front of me. So I need a wisdom saving throw. What kind of damage is it? Psychic. Okay. You said a wisdom save. Yes. What's your DC? 14. Well, he's got an 11, so... Awesome. So it takes 4d6 and, uh... And it must immediately use its reaction if available to move as far away from me as possible. Okay. So. It does so, however, it does so by flying up ten feet and uh, and then away. And uh, spine devils have this feature called flyby. The devil does not provoke an at opportunity attack when it flies out of an enemy's reach. Right. Which means a call so nor Adira can attack it. Gotcha. I rolled remarkably well for that damage. Um... For 10, 14, 19 damage. Nice. Anything else, Comfort? Uh, that's it. Okay. Uh, it call. You're up. Uh, the map still hasn't loaded for me, so what's the closest thing I can hit? Uh, you have to move forward five feet, and you'll be right in front of another Spine Devil. 
Uh, he goes 10. Will he have advantage? Yeah. Uh, so let's take a launch it up on. Oh, okay. Let's see. Well, actually, it's. What you call yeah, it? Do, 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 uh, do. Go to uh, Discord chat. Yeah, it's there. Okay. Sort of. Yeah, he's moved, but if he moves up in okay. front of the okay, camera. Okay, okay, here, 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 here. I don't know. Uh, Twitch. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm gonna flank a Dira. Yeah, right here. Yeah. Yep. And, uh... Yes. Yeah, I'm just gonna smack Big Boy there. Great sword. <laughs> Yay! Nice! Yay! Okay, fish Love for the crit. <laughs> fish for the crit. <laughs> yeah. No, not, not yet. yet. Oh, advantage. Advantage. Next level. Yeah. Mm. Do you? Do you think? Well, I have D6. I have those. You have how many? No, Jordy can roll it. He's got a bunch of D6. <laughs> 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 Fun. <laughs> he literally just ran right over his bed to go get them. Yeah, yeah, they are. Oh, <laughs> that's adorable. It is. I rolled three ones and a four. <laughs> hey, you know what the best part is, Jordy? What? You have great weapon master. Oh, I can re-roll those. <gasps> yes, re-roll the ones! I actually did the one and the twos, if I remember correctly. Yeah, ones and twos. I roll a six, a four. Stay. And a six. So how mm. much did you roll? And four. It was two, two, it was two sixes, two fours. Oh, I do have a D20. Neat. 20. Did you just find a D20 in your bag? Yep. Cool. Is, is it a D20 and not a spin down? Yeah. Let's have two spin downs and an actual D20. So I guess we gotta buy Jordy some dice. We gotta buy Jordy some dice. I'm, tell I'm telling you, when this quarantine's over, we're just going to night Night's Watch or something. Gotcha. Also, I, I maintain the just buy me some resin, I'll make him some. Um. <clears throat> It's still standing. No, that's twenty off of the sword. How much? What's his strength modifier? A lot. Twenty-three. It's dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The hell do I have in here? <laughs> <laughs> you have you an actual. Ba you have an well, actual bag of holding. Pretty much. Uh, Amaranth. Yes. You're up. Uh, Amaret is gonna like pull out final hour and just and fire the heavy crossbow at a uh, at um the one over by Kaistar. Okay. Which does not have a right on it, which is fine. Uh, that's probably gonna. Well, maybe. Uh, Thank you. No, that's an eleven. That misses. Yes, it does. And. Uh, bonus action, do it again. Okay, it's crossbow okay. expert. Uh, nope. Your bonus action will be a hand crossbow, dear. That's true. You just Never ignore mind. the loading property. Cool. <laughs> so, in, in the case of if you had multiple attacks, uh huh, you would ignore the loading property for your heavy crossbow and be able to use the heavy crossbow more than once. Gotcha. Cool. Thank you for, thank you for clarifying that. Yep. But the bonus action is you have to use the hand crossbow. That's fine. I'll do that. Which is has, has does have a right on it. Natural twenty. Very nice. Jesus. <sighs> Remember, all your damage dice are doubled. Yes, they are. Uh, two d six, and then two d four. I have those here. Ten 
and seven. Seventeen uh, total. How much? Seventeen total. Okay. Uh, that's my turn. Is that with Dex uh, mod on top? Oh shit! That's right. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, three. My Dex mod's three. It's dead. Okay. <laughs> Job. <clears throat> Good Azira, there's one target left. Climb over those boxes. <laughs> Whoops. You need a deck save. It failed. I rolled a two. Looks like a diamond. That one. Okay. Anything else, Adira? <laughs> Cute. And uh dissonant whispers, is it continually afraid of you? Or um, can it now move to attack something else? Um it does not say. I think it's. I think it's just immediate. Okay. Or till the end okay. of her turn, or your or his turn. It doesn't say. <laughs> well, it doesn't sure. matter because it's gonna go attack Jordy instead. Ooh. Okay. Well, it's gonna miss because I rolled a seven, and I know Ooh. your AC is higher than whatever I have to add <laughs> to that. Um. Does a sixteen hit you? Nope. I'm okay. Big boy. Uh, Kaiser, you're up. Well, I'm going to. Can I move up to here? So I'm flanking with a, 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 a No, a you cannot because you would have to climb on top of the barrels to do so. Fine, I'll just go beside him. No, it's uh, Q. It's more just that um, climb on top of the barrels to get on the other side because he had to come down to attack. Twenty-three. Whew. Yeah. Ten damage plus. Nope. Stop. Move the hunter mark. To him. <laughs> okay. He's dead. <laughs> so please um, stop. He's already with dead. Those creatures vanquished. Um, Hardy, what are you doing? I'm still smoking. Mm -hmm. I'm still smoking. It's just. Well, there's two doors. One to the left and one to the right. So which one are you going to? Should we have Dante scout for us? Let's check to see if we can hear anything or damage or traps or... <sighs> Is my speak with animals still active? Uh, how long does it last? Ten minutes. <laughs> yes, just barely. I will ask the cat. Um... Do you know if there's anything like better left or right, or are they? It's pretty similar. Doesn't matter. No, I, I don't right. know. I don't come down here. Okay. Okay. Can uh, comfort? Can can you tell him just to stay off to the corner? I I would rather not see him hurt. I do understand the common. Yeah, he understands it. you. You just oh. can't understand him. My apologies. Idea, open Heart's the door. <laughs> I'm done with these conversations. Oh. Meow. Could, yeah, could give you me do a something, check. you know, to help? I was helping. Hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Can we hear him? Yeah. I mean, he's invisible, not silent. Thank you. <laughs> like I said, I was helping. Uh, you don't hear anything on this side of the door. Yeah, investigation check. I want to check this door over here for traps, just in case. Investigation check. Yeah. <laughs> you don't seem to find any. I rolled a 24 on over here. It's not Team. trapped. Uh, Quentin. You open the door. Uh, Dante, when you walk in, more than 200 corked bottles of wine are displayed in seven-foot-tall wooden racks that span the west and south wall. Hmm. Empty wooden crates are stacked in the middle of the room. Hmm. It's a wine cellar. Uh, can I see if any one of those bottles opens up any sort of like secret compartment or whatnot, or is it just? Sure, give me an investigation check. Going full Batman. Investigation. Match. Yeah. Ooh. Nat twenty. Second like one of the night for me. Um. No, you you try several of them in different locations, and none of them seem to swing open a hidden. Mm. Although you did notice that some of them are pretty rare vintage. You're thinking <laughs> that it might land you somewhere, you know, at ten gold pieces per bottle. I would, I would, uh, I would take one. Okay. I take one of them, pocket it. There's nothing over here. Cool. <laughs> uh, so, with that offshooted room inspected, we are going to call it here for the night because we are just having much too much in the way of technical difficulties between the start and now with Roll20 being very laggy. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I figured so. everyone's in except for Molly. Nope, I'm still on. I got yeah. five in there. Two, three, four, yeah, but five. Yeah, just because Jordy's there doesn't mean that it's finished loading. Okay, right. sorry. Um, so okay. we're going to call it here for tonight. Um, hopefully all of our technical issues will be solved for next week as they continue on through this underbelly of the Vanthem Pervela. Um, we will now be on our weekend break, so no game on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But stick around for Monday as we come back to the escorts where... The two people who were doing research have figured out what this thing uh, thing is. Meanwhile, the two with the hearts of gold have been told, I'm stuck and I can't get out. Please help. Oh, no. Yeah. Tune in Monday to find out what happens there. Uh, Tuesday is still on a break. They will be back on the 21st of April. Yes. Looking forward to seeing how Vampire Valley by Night goes. I'm a big boy. Um, Wednesday, we are in the middle of fighting whatever tentacled monster we found in the sawmill. It's kicking my ass. <laughs> it's kicking all our asses. Yep. Um, and then we'll be back on Thursday to continue this adventure. One of Adira's visions has been found. Who knows when you'll find the rest. Good night, everybody. Be good to one another, especially in this trying time. Remember social distancing. And if you're looking for something to do because you're at home and have nothing better to do, head on over to our YouTube where all of our shows that have been streamed thus far on Twitch have been painstakingly uploaded and put into playlists by yours truly. Um and get caught up on all the things that you've missed. I might do that. So, uh, without further ado, be good to one another, and remember, roar for initiative.